and on to game two. Lionar this time. What about still on Magma? Yeah, it's pretty rough uh, coming up in the first round against Solifid. I think this is Solifid's more tempo deck, given that uh, he has two Lionar decks. One that's sort of like a really slow control Lionar, which I think is really good. Uh, and this one as well. It's totally fine. You can tell it's this one because it's running Magnetize, which I suppose we're going to see suck in this Kajata. I don't think you'd master him right. No, he's running Silver Riders. Yeah. So, Magnetize is doing a... something pretty cool there. I don't know how many people are running it, but it's a really nice utility card. And uh, when you're drawing two cards a turn, you know, a little cheap card can often uh, squeak in there without costing you too much. What about going in aggressive here, even though uh, Solfid's got a big, uh, big board? It's because he can heal himself up between a Mystic and a Twin Fang. Can be really scary, but I think in this situation it's under control. There's a couple of ways you could deal with it. You can trade in your entire board, or you can use Tempest. And if you're trading in your board, you can decide whether you want your Windblade to live or and you take one extra two and you take extra damage. Or whether you save the HP on yourself and the Windblade uh, dies. Or you can just Tempest and uh see what self it's gonna do. So he's hitting the Human Mystic, which... or is he? He's thinking about it. Yeah, that means he's gonna Tempest here. Because yeah, you can't move that uh, massive thing back. Oh, he's gonna use Healing Mystic for... to save his Windblade Adept. It's quite good. It's uh, 5 attack, that's a lot. Look at the stamina that's gone down. Well, that's kind of getting low already. A little bloodied. Yeah, I don't mind this healing, uh, healing mystic before Tempest. Like, the alternate would be to play the lion afterwards. But, yeah, it depends what Warbar has in his hand, whether he can ping off the adept or not. Like he's just gonna be forced to hit it, maybe? That's a lot of damage to take, you know. Really low if you have to hit that. What's this? What? He's repulsing it just. I mean, it lets him hit it and take the mana tile, I guess, but who need the mana tile for? Maybe he's got like a two drop and a great fortitude. Kajata. Alright. Oh no. I, I really don't like that, am I? You could have just. The Kajata just dies on board. You could have just killed the healing mystic and pushed the. The wind blade into a corner. Oh no, what is this? So everything is gone now, and Solfid's got quite a nice uh, board lead. What about uh, quickly uh, make his move burn? Decisive, I like that. Oh, it's a Flash Chimera. Yeah, that's pretty big. I think it's just going to get mastered him now. Yeah, better uh, just take out a lot of things before you do it. It's smart. And yeah, there. It's uh, going to either master him. Which is going to heal Water Bow back up. He's almost in single digit uh, HP there. Now he's uh, back and healthy again. 
And yeah, so it's a, a big HP gain for him, but Salford's still in a commanding lead of the board. And this uh, Regalia can be tough for Magmar to deal with. So I've been seeing a lot of people run uh, Rust Crawlers. I think it's really good, a 1 4. And almost every faction has a, an artifact that they're probably playing. So I thought I'd always see again. Yeah, this uh, needs some extra damage to be able to kill that sort of dead. Uh, eat him all or something. He doesn't have it. And he's kind of low as well, anyway. But you can't deal with the Alba, so your choices are to sort of ignore it and uh, try and kill your opponent by hitting face and just clear off the egg. Or to back up and. Uh, Wait a few turns to, you know, try and find something that will deal with it. It just depends uh, how scared are you of extra burst damage. Really. I don't think you can. Uh, it'd only be 6, but you'd have to 8. But then, once you're dead the next turn, you're kind of doing like 6 damage if you go in. Hmm. Yeah, so he's elected to back up. That makes a lot of sense. And just play the uh, Archon with 9 HP is going to likely protect you from that uh, big silver. Let's see what the response is. Just another Sylvar out of. Well, that, that is quite scary. Um, I'm not sure why I didn't kill the Healing Mystic or. I mean, it makes sense to not hit the Archon because it doesn't really achieve much, but. I mean, I guess if you hit the Healing Mystic, then the Archon can hit it, but. Healing Mystic can hit you anyway, so why wouldn't you not kill Healing Mystic? Because now Healing Mystic can kill an egg. Anyway, let's have a think about what Sulphid can do, because this MO might be able to get some work done. You can hit like two elders and an egg. Uh, Star Horn 2, so that's pretty good. Uh, just having a, a little think about. Um, if you can clear both those at both eggs, because with the Primus Fist, your uh, Archon has eight attack. So he's uh, magnetizing in for a good Immo spot, I believe. Yeah. Okay. And he is going to do the Primus Fist play, and then attack the Elder in front. Then Immo, then have Arjun uh, clear the other Silithar Elder. And, oh no, he's attacking the back one. So that's going to leave the the Elder close to Water Bow alive, but Arjun doesn't have to take the 6 damage hit and lose the Regalia charge. Um, yeah, I mean, I would have done the line I was saying, but this is uh, also acceptable. It's just a bit risky if he has a way to like clear your board or something. But um, through Archon, it's a little hard because, you yeah, know, like something like Plasma Storm Crust Extra now, there's no uh, Egg Morph or something. I wonder if uh, Metamorphosis or something would have done the business there. Yeah. I think you're probably going to magnetize the egg here. And you've already dealt with two, so maybe... You, I just don't think I would, but I can see why you might. And let's Arjun get the hit. I don't think that's all that valuable. I don't think it's magnetized. 
doing anything other than getting that egg, but maybe I'm wrong. Ooh, divine bond. So there's a uh, chance for lethal next turn. Even with the Iron Cliff dead, Bond on the Lion stealing 6 rex. Okay, now he's healed out of range now. But if he hadn't healed 4, he could still be uh, in the range. I don't think so. If it's too upset, we'll just uh, arc on the blade here. Keeps the pressure on. Wobba hasn't been able to gain too much traction. Like, he's plopped down all these massive great threats, but they've been answered. And once again, so if it's just uh, taken lead of the board. Obviously, not in a good spot with a, an arc on your face. You have to deal with that. He's got six cards and nine mana. I think even through Archon you can do some quite nice plays. Do like Metamorphosis for six and then Flash Harvester for three. It's always a good one. Clear any board. It's just a war beast, which does clear off the regalia at least. Gonna flash out something to protect him. Yeah, Randy Juvenet is keeping him in it just about. You can't get lethal this turn with the bond, but I. I think you probably can't lose if you just slap two provokes in his face and uh, maybe just Iron Cliff and Bond the uh, Archon. Just back off, have the line clear the Rejuvenator. It's going in. Seems like it might be a bit risky. 10 HP is probably alright if you've got two provokes protecting you. And the uh, Archon as well, making certain combos harder. Is he gonna hit that? Whoa, that seems unnecessarily risky. Uh, he's going for the full surround, which means Warbow can't play any minions first, but uh, isn't it still a bit scary? Like, um, Plasma Storm into. Uh, can you do Flight No, it's the Archon. Uh, it's still a, still a bit scary to me, but. Okay, there's the Plasma Storm, so let's see if there's something that we could do. Do you have four damage for. Three mana, but spells are more expensive. Flash. That cost one. And then your Elustator will cost two, right? Then he just wins if he has that. Does he? Yeah, I guess he doesn't have it because he's not doing it. Are you a Ether Scarif? He's hitting. What is it? Uh. 
Oh, I can all breathe out. It's just a Kajata. Oh. Yeah, that's just game. Oh, that was scary though. That was close. GG. Bonk.